Hey, welcome to another episode of geekoutdoors.com. If you are using Blender, then there's some things that you have to set up to make sure you get all the functionality. And one of the most important things is to set up your Blender path. And if you're not familiar with what that is, it's basically if you go to title and you go to animated title, if you try to use any of these animated titles, it will tell you that you need Blender version 2.78 or greater underneath the Blender path. And we're gonna show you what that means. So if you actually go to your edit preferences, then there is a path for Blender and a path for Inkscape. This is to do titles and stuff, but this is for animated titles. And I have done a video on this in the past, but that was for an older version of OpenShot. And right now we are currently on 2.4.4, at least that's the version that I have installed on my machine. And in terms of the version of the operating system running, I actually running Linux Mint 19.1 Tessa. And so what you will need to do is you need to install a newer version of Blender uh, in order for this to work and have it point to the right place. And so the easiest way you could do that is actually go to your software manager. Now this is for Linux Mint, so I went to administration software manager. Then I would simply look for a Blender, just type it in and you'll be able to find it. And here's Blender right here. So the version that's actually on the software manager right now is 2.79 beta. And this is newer than the 2.78 that they're recommending, 2.78 or greater. And if you go to the website right now at blender.org, it looks like that's the same version, 2.79b or beta. So let's go ahead and install this and see if it works. So you can install all these things, put in your password and see if this works. Okay, so I just got done installing it and you'll know if it's installed is you have the option to launch or remove or if you go to your menu and then you go to graphics, Blender's right there. Okay, so let's go ahead and launch this to see if it works. So there it is. This is Blender 2.79 beta. Now technically your OpenShot animated titles should work. So let's go ahead and test that out. We'll go back to OpenShot, go back to title and then animated title. And let's try that again. And there it is. It works. It doesn't give you that warning anymore. And you know, you could try different ones. And you know it's working because obviously it doesn't give you the warning. And it'll give you a preview right here. And it'll have to render each and every frame. And that's actually how you would actually set up Blender for a newer version. And it's pretty much the same way uh, as I had it before. And so that's all you would need to do. So once again, this is for Linux Mint 19.1 uh, Tessa and uh, also the version of OpenShot that I'm running uh, is actually 2.4.4. And if you are actually on Windows, I also have a tutorial on how to do that as well. I will leave that in the description area below. And so if you actually had any thoughts on this, be sure to leave that in the comments area below. And if you did want to see my entire OpenShot tutorial series, I will also leave the playlist in the description as well. So as always, if you did get value out of these videos, be sure to share, like, and subscribe. Hey geeks, if you are a creative geek like me and you wanted to learn how to create content on YouTube and other places on the internet, then check out my Go Content Creators Group where you'll get access to 30 videos plus additional content for all the creative geeks out there. And the best part of it is, all of this is free. Simply head over to the link below, check out my page, and sign up for my Go Content Creators group. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you on the other side. Thanks for checking out this episode. And as always, if you like these videos, be sure to click on the subscribe button. And for full written content, audio content, and additional geek stuff, head over to geekoutdoors.com, and I'll see you outdoors on the very next episode.